In last video of computer, you have seen and studied unit 1 that is history and uses of computer. In that chapter, you have seen the history of computer, how the computers are used in the earlier age and now how, what are the uses of a computer, right? So, in today's video, we will start a new unit that is unit 2, features of a computer, okay? Computer is an electronic machine and it works on it on. Okay, so before we start the chapter, tell me what do you mean by features of computer? Features means qualities. Qualities or characteristics of a computer. Each human being has some qualities or characteristics. Just as humans, computers are also having some characteristics or qualities. These are called as features of a computer. So let us see some features of a computer. As you know, a computer is a machine. It helps you to do many things quickly, easily and better. Computer can help you to draw and color pictures. Type and design letters and cards. Do sums. Watch cartoons. Listen to songs. Do homework. Play games. Store information. Send emails to your friends. You also know that the computer is not an ordinary machine. It is a smart machine. Characteristics of the computer Speed A computer works very fast. It can do billions of sums very quickly. It save us a lot of time. Accuracy When we work, we can sometimes become careless and make mistake. But a computer does not make mistake. It is very accurate and reliable. Diligence Steady work If we have to do the same work again and again, we lose interest in the work. But a computer can do some task again and again. The computer never get tired or bored. Large memory It takes us a lot of time to memorize certain things. We also forget many things we learn. But a computer has a large memory and can store huge amount of data, word, numbers and pictures. Multifunctional As shown, we have already seen, a computer can do a wide variety of tasks like adding numbers, drawing, pictures, printing letters and playing music. These are some of the important characteristics of computers. Okay, so just now you have seen the features of computer or the qualities or the characteristics of a computer. Okay, so just recall it. First one is a computer is an automatic machine. Once you give the data and write commands, it works on its own. Okay. Second one is a computer works very fast. It can perform hundreds and thousands of data within a second. Okay. Next one is words of versatile, words multitasking and multipurpose. A computer is a multitasking and multipurpose machine. It can do different things at the same time. Okay. Next is computer is a versatile, multitasking and multipurpose machine. It can do different different things at the same time. Okay, you can give it commands, then it can perform different things at the same time. This is reliable and accurate. Computer is a reliable and accurate machine. It always gives accurate results and it is very reliable. It can do repetitive tasks again and again thousand times without getting bored or tired. So these are the features of a computer. Just like human beings, you are having so many different parts of your body, right? So computer is also having different different parts. So now let us learn the main parts of parts of a computer. As we know, a human body is made up of various parts like eyes, nose, ears, hands and legs. Similarly, 
A computer is also made up of various parts. All these parts together make a computer work. Now let us learn about the different parts of a computer. A computer is a machine that has four main parts. Monitor, CPU, keyboard and mouse. Let us learn about these parts one by one. Monitor. A monitor looks like a TV screen. It shows the typed text and the work we do on a computer. It also displays the result. We can see movies and play games using a monitor. Have you seen a black box attached to your computer? That black box is known as CPU, that is Central Processing Unit. CPU is called the brain of the computer just as our brain controls all the different parts of the body and makes the work together. Similarly, the computer controls all the other parts of the computer and makes them work together. All the parts of the computer are connected to the CPU. Keyboard A keyboard is made up of several small buttons called keys. Just as you use pencil to write on a paper, a computer also needs a keyboard to type any alphabet, number, etc. There are 104 keys on a standard keyboard. Mouse A computer mouse looks like a real mouse. It has two buttons and a scroll wheel. A mouse is used for clicking and selecting files and pictures on the screen. It also helps us to draw pictures and play games. Okay, so what are the main parts of the computer? work we do on a computer. Next one is CPU. CPU means central processing unit. Whatever calculations you are doing, it is done by this box called CPU. Next one is keyboard. Keyboard gives all the commands or data, whatever data or commands we want to give it on the computer to CPU. It gives through 